So, there was speculation circulating online regarding Blackmagic's potential announcement of a new cinema camera that supports the L-Mount. We already know that Blackmagic is not currently a member of the L-Mount Alliance, which currently consists of Leica, Sigma, Panasonic, Lights, and DJI. Moreover, Blackmagic may announce a full-frame cinema camera that is compatible with the L-Mount. So, what will this new full-frame cinema camera look like, and when can we expect to see this? Let's find out. Currently, Blackmagic Design offers pocket cinema cameras with three different mount systems, PL, EF, and Micro Four Thirds. And as per recent information from Mirrorless Rumors, there are reports suggesting that Blackmagic has allegedly reached an agreement to become a part of the L-Mount Alliance. If these reports are accurate, this move could potentially broaden Blackmagic's customer base by offering a cost-effective lens mount for its popular camera models, like the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 6K and the Blackmagic Ursa Mini Series. This means joining the L-Mount Alliance would be a strategic move for Blackmagic design. In our opinion, it's highly logical and reasonable. The L-Mount would greatly benefit from increased market share and a wider range of options from reputable companies which can encourage users to switch to this mount. Moreover, if this move also supports a manufacturer that has a presence in both the L-mount and E-mount systems like Sigma, it indirectly benefits the whole E-mount ecosystem as well. But why is it not still here? Possibly, the development of a full-frame pocket camera poses a challenge due to the limitations of currently available, affordable technology. A larger sensor in such a camera generates more heat, necessitating a larger body for effective heat dissipation. In comparison to its competitors, Blackmagic Design, or BMD, employs higher bit rates, and FPGAs instead of ASICs, which can potentially generate even more heat. Likewise, BMD's new 12K Super 35 camera is considered a flagship model. It's primarily intended for professional users, particularly those in the mainstream industry segment, rather than independent filmmakers relying on self-funding. These working professionals are often capable of either renting or owning expensive Super 35mm Zeiss, Ari, or even more costly anamorphic lenses. Some even argue that full frame has become a standard in photography, but in reality, Super 35 remains the standard in cinematography. Major cinema camera manufacturers like Ari, Red, Sony, and Canon have embraced the full-frame photographic standard. Blackmagic stands as the only notable exception among these camera makers. Hence, whether it relates to concerns about heating or simply a preference for different sensor sizes, it appears to be a perfect time for BMD to venture into new horizons. If the rumors are correct, we can surely see noticeable changes in the filmmaking industry. Because for many makers, BMD is still the first choice. The way this manufacturer has captured the cinema market share, all other brands will follow in the same footsteps to make this a household feature. Sources indicate that this camera's potential release is expected towards the end of 2023. Till then, we can just anticipate all the possibilities. What do you think? Are you excited about this upcoming full-frame L-mount Blackmagic? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. Consider subscribing for more content like this, and as always, thanks for watching.